So for my birthday, I got a $225 Amazon gift card, and I spent it, got all my stuff. Some of the ones are ones I've already seen. I pretty much watched um, almost all the ones I've already seen, but I watched some that I haven't seen. I've already reviewed some of the ones that um, I uh, haven't seen, but there were three, such as Godzilla, Mothra, and King Ghidorah, Giant Monsters, All That Attack, Son of Godzilla, um, Godzilla 1985, which I don't have with me right now, and Godzilla vs. Megalon. I'm going to start with, um, Godzilla, Mothra, and King Ghidorah, Giant Monsters All That Attack, because that's the first one I watched. I was excited to watch this movie because, um, uh, it's, I really, um, like, um, Mothra and King Ghidorah and obviously Godzilla because they're really good monsters. Um, if it just had Angiris, it would have been the ul my ultimate rumble because I, I really like Angiris, he's cool. But, um, I was still looking forward to it because, um, it's three great monsters. Um, they also have another one, Baragon. I don't really know much about him. It's the only time I've seen him. I think he was new. I think it's his only appearance. I don't know. Um, but I was really looking forward to it. And, um, you know, I don't think they disappointed. I mean, it was a really good movie. Definitely one of the best guys in the movies I've seen so far. And I definitely really did enjoy it. I mean, they used, um, the design of Godzilla that they used in um, Mothra vs. Godzilla where he kind of has those weird eyebrow things and he doesn't have any like eye um, he, he just has like white eyes that's nothing but white um, he did look cool and King Ghidorah and Mothra look cool Mothra looked kind of weird but um, I still really enjoyed it it had a really deep storyline to it well not I, yeah, I did have a deep storyline too with the whole, um, Guardian Monsters things, and, um, I really liked how they, um, were like, um, the characters were, um, B-movie, um, directors. <coughs> they made, like, low-budget stuff. Um, and one thing that you're probably thinking I'm going to complain about that I'm not going to is the dub because I didn't watch the dub I watched it in Japanese with the English subtitles but people are saying the English dub is really bad so I'm glad that I watched it in Japanese it's the original version um the ending was a little I'm not sure what happened I mean I'm obviously not going to say what happened um but it's really weird I think I mean, I'm not sure what happened. I think the viewers are supposed to decide what happened, but it's like, what happened? <laughs> but, um, the acting was good, um, especially by a female. It's hard to, um, you know, review acting when the, when they're not speaking English, but it was still fairly good. Um, I didn't really like how, um, the reporters only cared about her surviving the female character because she was the best reporter. They didn't really care about her herself surviving. They only cared that, oh, she's our best, um, well, not reporter, um, actress, um, her, um, dying, but, um, it was a very enjoyable movie. One thing that I liked is that you actually saw Godzilla kill people. I mean, most of the time you just see him walking. I feel like the only other time you've really seen Godzilla kill somebody is, um, in Godzilla 2000. I mean, you do see him, uh, like, you do see the airplanes and he goes with a blast with his breath, but, I mean, you don't really see the person, but you see the people that he kills. I mean, there's a great moment where, um, he kills somebody, you're like, oh, <laughs> I mean, I really... One thing that was cool is that Godzilla was a villain, and Mothra has never been a villain, but King Ghidorah has always been a big 
bad person. I mean, actually, um, Godzilla has been a hero and King Ghidorah a villain, where he, um, fights King Ghidorah as a hero, and Ghidorah is a villain, but this time, um, this time Godzilla is, um, the villain, and King Ghidorah is the hero, and I thought that was really, um, interesting, um, how they did that. It was also cool how, um, in Godzilla vs. King Ghidorah, they were both, um, villains. Um, I kind of like it more when, um, when the monsters are both bad. I don't really like viewing Godzilla as a hero. Like in Godzilla vs. Space Godzilla. I didn't like him being a hero in that movie. I just think, I like it when, um, when, kind of like in Godzilla Final Wars, where he helps the humans and he turns on them. I mean, that's what Godzilla should do in all of his movies, you know? He shouldn't just be a straight up hero. Um, but I really enjoyed Godzilla Mothra and King Ghidorah Giant Monsters All Out Attack. It was a very fun, very enjoyable. And I definitely think if you're a Godzilla fan and you haven't seen it, then you should definitely check it out. Because it's a very good Godzilla movie. It's very interesting.